Hello, I'm Papa Steve Herringer, and it's uh, my honor to welcome you to the Herringer Estates uh, Winery and Vineyards in Clarksburg, California, where I'm uh, delighted to share some of our 150-year agricultural history with you today. This is a International Harvester TD40, and it's one of the early track machines. Uh, Actually, they were, uh, they started to come into being right at the turn of the century, but it was until, oh, until the 20s or the 30s when they beefed them up enough to where they could, they could run in the fields. And TD stands for track diesel. So this is a real innovative uh, engine that International Harvester put together. It starts, you start it on gas, which is a higher combustion than diesel. And then once the engine warms up a little bit, you switch to the diesel, which is cheaper, and runs on diesel. And this is one of the survivor pieces of equipment from our, from our older operation. My, my uh, grandfather purchased this machine new in 1937. And, uh, and it was purchased for the soft ground in the Delta, the wheel tractors in the light peat grounds, which we were farming some down uh, below Cortland, uh, wouldn't hold a wheel tractor up but the track with so much ground space with so much uh, uh, pressure on the ground or uh, weight on the ground uh, spread out over a long distance worked very well and uh, and we had about a dozen of these uh, 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 track diesel tractors uh, that we used actually into the 70s from the 40s all the way into the 70s uh, this particular uh, tractor was sold by my grandfather to a local family, uh, the Borges family, who farmed with it for many years. And they ac actually adopted the tractor for a irrigation pump. And that's why you see the big pulley on the back. The big pulley on the back would have driven a pump that had a, a stinger in the ditch or canal. And that's what the apparatus on the front was. It carried the, the uh, stinger or the suction. and. Um, uh, and so it became it became a function uh, of uh, irrigation uh, more so than than doing uh, groundwork. I'm real proud of this tractor uh, because it is one of the the survivor pieces from our old operation. And uh, uh, an international harvester at the time was a very innovative. They were in business from the early 1900s, right at the turn of the century, up until the early 80s and they cratered badly unfortunately because they were a, just a dynamite innovator uh, for all kinds of ag tractors and agricultural implements. So I want to thank you for sharing a little bit of your time with us today. I want to welcome you out to Herringer Estates uh, Vineyard and Winery and uh, you can come out and uh, enjoy the abundance of rusty iron and the fine wine.